Hi, I'm The Rap Critic, and I'm here to break down the worst lyrics I've ever heard in the last 30 days. Did you just say that your own record label owner is retarded? I mean, what else was I supposed to get from that? Your boss is Birdman, he makes a brr noise sometimes, and I can only assume that the noise Birdman makes when he heard this beat reminds you of a sound that a mentally retarded person would make. I mean, what do you say to defend that? Oh no, I meant retarded in a good way. I just don't think that conversation would work. I mean, rappers are known to be pretty sensitive. For God's sakes, LL Cool J started a beat with cannabis just because cannabis said he wanted to borrow the mic that was tattooed on his arm. I mean, if that can be the basis for a lengthy rap beef, surely associating someone's catchphrase with literally being retarded must have caused a bit of a rift between you two. Well, that or Birdman's shady business practices that have led to literally every artist on his label jumping ship after a few years. But you know, who's to say? So Missy Elliott decided to turn the lights down low for this next song, making a sexy, chilled out piece about a romantic evening. Booty, 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 booty. Romantic. Really? Do me, do me, do me, do me. Still romantic. Can I put my booty, booty up in your spaghetti? What? No, this is no longer romantic. Get your butt out of my spaghetti. Why would you even put your ass on someone's spaghetti in the first place? This is... Is that a fetish? Are there spaghetti bowl sitters out there? I mean, this can't be a metaphor or a euphemism, right? Because, I mean, what's a bowl of spaghetti supposed to represent? Well, I guess a strand of spaghetti is a phallic metaphor, but I don't think that's the metaphor most women want to think about. Wow, Jay, I always knew you were in older MC, but I didn't think you were heliocentric denier old. But everyone knows that line and rips on him for it. The, the lyric that really gets to me is this one. Give my lady's dick my young hoes pee pee. So my question is, how young exactly are these women that they would be referring to your dick as a pee pee? And wait, so you're saying you give them two different types of dicks? Like, like one's a big dick and one's a little one, so did, uh, are you saying you have two dicks? Is this a question I want an answer to? Or are you saying something else entirely, like you give dick to the grown women, and for the girls that aren't ready yet, you instead pee on them? If so, that would explain the common interest between two musicians that led to this album. Yep, in 2015, I just made that joke, didn't I? I'm ashamed of myself.